WFNN. Headline News Update. Okay, folks, Larry Pesaveno setting in for TFNN today at my usual time. I'll be back tomorrow. Our guest will be Shane Smolian of uh, WolfTrader.com. We're going to be doing the show here in about an hour, but before we get to a catch up with the markets, we're down quite a bit, several hundred points in the Dow. NASDAQ down a couple hundred, S&P down quite a bit. Uh, as you remember, folks, over the past uh, five or six weeks here, we've had several major people here talking about the low due in late October, early November, starting with uh, Norm Winsky, Stan Harley, Shane Smullyan. Uh, I know I'm going to forget some. Bill Meridian. Uh, there are just uh, you know a hand well a handful of them, five or six. Ain't this is where you want to look at because there's a strong seasonal for the market to bottom in late October, uh, early November. And here we are looking at uh, early November is going to be coming in next Wednesday. So we're going to be looking at a pretty good bottom in here. Uh, Shane will be talking to us about this tomorrow. But remember, folks, we have a lunar eclipse, uh, you know, which is a full moon. Uh, with It's going to be very, very interesting. So let's uh, pay attention to that. That will be coming in on the 28th, which is... Uh, Saturday, and then of course we're coming in here Friday at the end of October. Boy, that's where you've got to be looking to be uh, a buyer, folks, in my opinion. If you just look at the stocks, which you're going to go through these uh, coming up in the next segment, you know, where we are, you know, you, you can't get anybody to buy them when they're down, but when they're up, everybody wants to buy them. But uh, that's the key uh, to looking at this is buy them when they're crying and sell them when they're yelling. And it's old Warren Buffett says, buy when there's blood in the street. And boy, there's getting close to be blood in the street on some of these because they've hit them pretty hard. We'll be covering Apple and we'll also be covering Tesla and uh, also uh, Amazon because these were stocks that they were interested over here in the UK. And when I gave my predictions, uh, people thought I was a little off center, but, you know, maybe I am. <laughs> they might be right. Who knows? Anyway, we'll go over some of that stuff and look at it. Also, we've had a a big move down in crude oil, and I'll tell you why that caused a slight problem. It's hard to get some people to short oil, folks, when they're in the oil business. <laughs> but anyway, that's neither here nor there. But don't uh, don't fret, folks. There's some, you know, whatever goes down usually bounces back up, and this time it could be a real doozy. So let's stay tuned, see what we got on store today. So live every day in an attitude of gratitude. May God bless, and stay on for another 50 minutes. We'll have a lot of fun. 